Oh my god, check this out. Right, Petra in Jordan. So now I'm flying from Cairo to Amman. I haven't got a clue where I'm supposed to check in. I'm flying Egypt Air again, so it's gotta be here somewhere. Can I have a good seat, is that okay? It's window exit, sir. Thank you very much. Cheers. Okay. How long is the flight? One hour only. Oh, it's only one hour? Ah, awesome, thank you. Oh, one hour flight, that'll do. Right, I'm through security. I ended up just chilling for an hour after it, to be honest, and just figuring out the next move. I arrive into, how are you, mate, you right? How are you? Yeah, all good, mate. <laughs> so I arrive into Amman at 7 p.m. Then the drive to Petra's three hours. So I need to be making that drive tonight and then stay by Petra. I was looking at like hotels, Airbnbs, like close to Petra. And I found this really quirky one. This woman owns a cave and she hosts like 10 guests. And it was like 41 pounds to stay in this cave. So yeah, I booked it. She's not got back to me yet because obviously I've only just booked it. And now I'm jumping on this flight. I'm probably not going to hear off her until I get to Amman. So tonight could get pretty pretty eventful if I end up sleeping in a cave. And then, what time is the flight tomorrow? I don't even know, I need to check that. Right, let's jump on this flight to a man. Cheers, thank you very much. Have a nice evening. And we are in Amman, Jordan. It was my first time in Egypt, and now it's my first time in Jordan. Third country of this trip. We're nearly halfway there. But well, we're not really, are we? We've done two out of seven. We're getting there, though. We are getting there. Um, I don't have visa. It said that I could get a visa when I enter. Discounter visa. Ah, okay, so I need to get a visa from there. Oh, get a visa there, then come back yes, here. Yes. I can just buy a visa here, can I? There we go. Visa bought. It cost me 47 quid. There you go. All good. Cheers, thank you. Right, visa sorted. I am now officially in Jordan. The time now is 7.37 p.m., so it's getting late now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ring the host of the Airbnb and then basically see what the plan is. Uh, hi, Joe, it's Simon. I'm staying with you tonight with the Airbnb. Where are you now? I'm currently in the airport now and I'm gonna get a taxi over to you. Is that okay? For the cave, it's late. For the cave, it's late. But we will try, no problem. Okay, thank you so much. Joe. Thanks, bye, bye bye. Obviously, he said it's late, but he's still gonna take me to the cave. I just need to find a taxi. Taxi, how much to Petra? 100. One, it's too expensive. Uber is much less. Yeah, do you see? Yeah, I'm just, I need to get a taxi to Petra. Uber's saying like 36, and this guy's caught me 100. But I thought already, and I just told him I know you. Ah, okay, cool. Would you recommend just get this, mate? Or? Yeah. Oh, but yeah, no worries. Cheers, mate. Honestly, thanks so much for your help. Man. Have a good one. See you later, dude. Happy days. What a useful guy. So the local guy was basically charging me 100 Jordanian pound, which is like 110 UK, I like to guess. But then an Uber is 36, so it works out 40 pounds. It's less than half the price. So I just need to get an Uber now. Right, I found the Uber, but the only problem is now, because obviously it's gone eight and it's a three hour drive there, and obviously they'd need to come back. It's basically just said finding right for the past 10 minutes. So apparently there's another app called Kareem, so I'm gonna try this. Kareem, is it? Yes, Kareem. Yeah, download Kareem, download yeah? Download Kareem and ask me, okay. Okay, cool. I think we've sorted it. So everything's all good, yeah? Yes, yes. We're all sorted. Cheers, thanks. Okay. The taxi driver's now just okay. speaking to Joe from the Airbnb, yeah. just to work out where I'm getting dropped off. All good? Okay, okay. All good. Do you know where you're going, give, yeah? Uh, he will give us your uh, navigation. Okay, so he's going to message me, is he? Yes, yes. Okay, brilliant. Thank you. We got the address off Joe, and his address specifically is Little Petra. I haven't got a clue where that is. But the fact that it's got Petra in it sounds positive. We're heading there now. It's going to be like three and a bit hours. That's the longest I have ever been in a taxi. To be honest, I am shattered now, so I'm gonna try and make the most of this, try and get some sleep. The taxis ended up being 76 Jordanian pounds. It was like 36 on Uber, but obviously nobody was accepting. The guy at the airport was said like 100, so in the end, I'm just grateful to be in a taxi and to be there. But yeah, half 11, it's gonna be late and another early start. Anyway, I'm gonna get some sleep and we'll be there soon.
I have had no sleep whatsoever. The time now is 23.46. I said to the guy I'd be there an hour and 46 minutes ago. I've let him know, but it's not ideal getting there at this time. Just to show you the map, I landed in a man north of Jordan, and I'm now where that blue dot is. I've traveled a fair bit. We've definitely been in here three hours now. The sat nav saying, how long's it saying, 10 minutes? Seven minutes. Seven minutes, Seven minutes. awesome, so we're nearly there. The roads here are crazy, aren't they? Snaky. Yeah, very snaky. <laughs> I didn't think I'd be driving on the Jordanian mountains in a taxi at 10 to midnight tonight. Right, here we go, I think we're here. Thank you very much for that. Thank you, appreciate you your help. Is it Joe? No. Joe, I need to ring a, do you know Joe? Maybe this car. Yeah, maybe. Joe. Joe. Manato, how are you? This is Joe. I grabbed my yeah. bag out the booth, is that okay? Thank you very much, man. So, where am I staying tonight? In the cave, or? Yeah, in the cave. Does the cave have a door? Yeah. <laughs> There's not like snakes or anything in the cave, is there? You don't know, this is nature. You don't know? I'm not a big fan of the wildlife, to be honest. Right, we're proper off-road here, aren't we? So, are we in the middle of nowhere now? Yes. Will you know your way back? Because this isn't even a road, is it? I'll stay there with you. Ah, okay, awesome. I'll give you a long. Ah, I appreciate that. Wow, it's amazing how you know where we're going. Yeah. Because it's like, it's Sometimes just rocks, the car isn't it? the way by themselves. <laughs> Whoa, we are literally in the middle of nowhere. You can't see anywhere beyond the bottom of my feet. Whoa, look at that spider. Oh my God, there's some weird things moving. Ah, so this is the cave. How often do you stay out here? Almost the every day. Yeah. Every day, flipping heck. Oh, thank you so much for this. You want to sit outside? Yeah, shall I bring a light with me? Oh, I have another light. So that's just gone fired, is it? Or? Yeah, this is make light now. How cool is that from nylon? And how long will that do that now for? If you nobody touch it, to stay maybe for another day. A week. Maybe for a month. week? Flip. Yeah. Oh, tea would be lovely, thank you. Sage tea. Sage tea? Yeah, yeah I, I've never tried it, but I'll give it a go. It's very good for stomach. You, if you drink it, you never get stomach from the food. So like deli belly in India and deli, stuff like that? Deli belly drink. Is that what they call it? Yeah, yeah, deli, no deli. way. Right, I'm gonna hit the deck for the night. My sage tea is going down a treat. My bed's there, and we're leaving the door to the cave open. So hopefully I won't get eaten. Good night. Morning. The time is 10 past seven in the morning. I had a cracking sleep on here, to be honest. Just not enough of it. Now that it's light outside, I'll show you what it looks like. So to show you the cave, that's where I slept last night. And as you can see, like it's in the mountain. How long is Petra from the main gate? If you want to see everything inside of the bar, you need at least three days. Three days? But you know, like the main site is the treasury, isn't it? How long does it take to walk to the treasury from, from the, the main entrance? From the main gate, it's about 45 minutes. Ah, okay, 45 minutes walk. Yeah, yeah. Just to show what we're driving through, I don't know how well you could see it last night. We are literally in the middle of nowhere. Do many other people come down this road or? Yeah, local people. Yeah. Thank you so much. All the best. Thank you. Where's the visitor centre? Straight, straight down there. Straight, front of you. You will see yeah. the, the old tours going. Okay, cool. Buy the ticket and then you go through the mountain. And then back here for 1pm. 1 o'clock, the driver will be Will you, you be here. back here at 1 or will you... I, will, I don't know. I will see. If I don't we'll see you again, we thank you so much for everything. All the best. Yeah, definitely. Go. We'll catch up again. See you later. Bye. What a guy and what a 
trip this is turning out to be. The time now is 8.27 a.m. So I need to be in the airport for 4 p.m. Joe is gonna sort me a taxi back. So I've got four hours at Petra. Well, four hours from now until I've gotta get back to that hotel. And he said it's like a 45 minute walk. So I should have enough time. I think I'm coming to the entrance now of the national park or whatever it is. So I'm gonna put this mic away. Welcome to Petra. How much is it in JD, did you say? 51. 51 JD. Cheers, thanks very much. My name's Simon, how about you? Awab. Awab? Awab. Awab. Yeah. Awab. I bumped into Awab on the way in here. So, were you born in Petra? Yeah, I was born in cave. So you were born in a cave yes, in I Petra? Yes, I was born in cave in Petra, yes. So do you still live in the cave? Yeah, I still live in a cave here, yeah. Behind How's life easy. living in a cave? It's very simple life, easy life. And yeah. what about food and stuff we, like that? Yeah, well, it's easy to buy. It's, there's the... Oh, village. the shops down yeah. here, yeah. is there? So how do you shower in the caves? I have a shower in the cave and I have electricity. You've got electricity in yeah, the cave? Yeah, like sun power. Have you got PlayStation? Uh, no, no PlayStation. <laughs> I just have uh, the TV. You've got a TV in yeah. there? Yeah. Mate, Maybe I need time. to live in a cave. Is there well, a spare cave for me? <laughs> well, uh, you can choose one and we can give it to you. Mate, that sounds good to me. Just from sleeping in that cave last night, I had like five hours sleep and I had a really good night's sleep and yeah. there was like no phone signal, no, no noise, it was no, dark. It, That's almost better, this isn't is, it? This is relaxed to your brain when it's exactly. uh, no voice, no people. Yeah. To enjoy uh, the sleep. In the night. Yeah. It's very nice. Uh, I need to spend more time in a cave. For me, my life is very easy in the cave. My yeah. Friend. Easy life. You That's know? what you want. You just want an easy life. Just, you don't want to be posting videos on no. YouTube. It's stressful. <laughs> stressful. <laughs> We do come in the night when they finish work. We come sit together, make food in the fire. Really? Yeah. It's well, all the people come together. Yeah. So what would you like generally have for tea? Yeah, we make barbecue. Barbecue? Yeah, oh, barbecue. Okay. Living in a cave with a TV, having yeah. barbecue. <laughs> yeah, this sounds really good, you know. I am happy with my life here, really. And you know what? That's the most important thing, is that you're happy. Yeah. It doesn't matter what you do, where you are, as long as you're, you're happy, happy, that's the no main problem. thing. Yeah. Exactly. Is, because when you're not happy, there is no life. Exactly. Exactly, money is nothing. Thing. Money doesn't make it, happiness. It 100% doesn't bring happiness. No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh, Check this wild. out. The third wonder, Petra. The second. Can you go inside no, there? It's not allowed. How deep does it go through there? 20, uh, 15 meters inside only. 15 meters yeah, inside? Ah, three, okay. Um, oh, it goes down as well. Three floor of the city of Petra, you know. So is there still like treasures in there the, and stuff there like that? It's not a treasure. They call it, the local people, they say it's a treasure, but it's a tomb for the king of the goddess. Ah, okay. How old is this? 2,000 years. 2,000 years? More than 2,000 years. More than 2,000 years. years. That is something else, that. Incredible place, isn't it? How many tourists come here a day? In the high season, like 7,000. A day? A day, but now Jeez. it's low season, it's like 500, 600. Five, 600 a day? 1,000 sometimes. How do you get to the top of the cliffs? They're here? Yeah, them taking a picture yeah, up there. Yeah, we are going that way. Oh, you can get up there? Yes, we oh, can. Oh, perfect, let's yes, go. Nice. Mate, which way are you taking me here? Take you all to see the treasury from the top. Cool. Very oh. nice of you. You will love it, my friend. I appreciate it, mate. Whew. Trying to carry this heavy bag up here. How many times have you been up here, Awaz? 1,288,000. <laughs> There's a dog up here. What's the dog's name? Tequila. Tequila. Can I stroke the dog? Yeah. Right. Oh, what a lovely dog. Welcome. Nice to meet you, man. Do you live up here? Yeah. No way. That's amazing. So where do you sleep? Over there? Sometimes here, sometimes here. Sometimes there, yeah, sometimes... Wherever. Wow. Best one. fit in the world. Mate, are you mad? Look how high that is. So were you born in Petra? I was born in a cave. You were born in a cave? He was born in a cave and you too. Does someone else live up here with you or just no, you? No, my, by myself. How do you shower here then? With the bottle, you know. Is that how you shower? You fill that up? Ah, okay, and then you just tip it over. I've been chilling up here for like an hour now. Mate, don't get too close. No problem. No problem, are you joking? So you're 26? 
Yeah. And then, how long have you lived in this space? When I was six years. When you were six years old? So you've lived here for 20 years? Yeah. That's amazing. There's something like proper powerful about just chilling here. It's just dead quiet and stuff, isn't it? No phone signal, huh? no Wi-Fi, no nothing. No, just there, chilling. No, there's Wi-Fi. There's Wi-Fi here? Yeah? Yeah. Where's your router? What if, yeah, there it is. Ah, so you have Wi-Fi? Yeah. So do you have a TV here then? Yeah. You do? Yeah. How do you charge? Sun. Oh. Has anybody ever fallen off this? No. No one's ever fallen off? Not yet. Not yet. Maybe soon. Awad's nearly fallen off today. What was Awad today? <laughs> <laughs> I could literally chill here all day. Look at it. The place is just beautiful and there's like, it's so chilled and there's like a vibe about it. I've definitely got to come back here and like maybe have a couple of nights and just leave the phone at home. Uh, okay. We should probably get going soon. Because we're going to take the donkey to shortcut. Ah, we won't get donkey, no donkey. Good. I'll just walk, I don't want the donkey to get too hot. What time is it? Uh, 11. Time, it's love. <laughs> here he goes, the poet's time. back. Time, it's love. <laughs> Mate, I'm coming back here to stay with you. A hundred, and I'm gonna bring loads of food and stuff and we'll have like a proper barbecue. Well, what we'll do, because I need to get back for the taxi, we'll leave the donkey, mate, and then we'll just walk back. Should we make a move? Yeah, I'll do. Yes. Ah. Absolute pleasure, mate. Next time, whiskey together. Yeah, next time I'll bring a big bottle of Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels. And we'll have the I best night ever. Yeah, I love, you love I Jack love Daniels? Ah, oh, there we go. Have nice to meet you, too. Look after yourself. Nice to meet you, mate. Nice to meet you. All the best, man. Enjoy your time. Yeah, thank you, mate. Now for the fun part, trying to get down. And we are at the bottom. Oh, is he up there, is he? That's where we were, right up the top there. If anyone ever goes to Petra, you've got to go up there. So Petra's here, you walk all the way, walk all the way up, and you've got to go and see that guy up there. When I was leaving, I tried to give Audi some money and he just wouldn't accept it. I managed to make him take some British money, at least for a souvenir. We've just come into another part of Petra now, and there's loads of caves, like, into the cliff. Awath has got himself a donkey. Does anybody still live in these caves, mate? But there's still only for my family live behind this mountain. Ah, okay. Still live in the cave. And we are coming to the end. This is the end, is it? Yeah, this is the entrance. Ah, okay. Yeah. So this is where I came in. Thank you so much for everything. I appreciate it. That view from the thing was crazy, wasn't it? Maybe next time with Jack Daniel. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you later, mate. Thank you. See you later. Bye. What a cool guy. I always meet cool people. I just find it better though. Just It's just my way that I turn up to places. I don't really have anything planned. Like literally, I was walking to the entrance. He was like, oh, you need guide, you need guide. And then today happened. Honestly, what a day. I'll be coming back to Jordan 100%. Oh, right. Here's the Sunset Hotel here. I've got 10 minutes spare, so I'm all good. I'm going to stock up on some drinks and then the taxi should be here. Taxi, yeah? Yeah. A man airport, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. What an absolute find they were. They're decent as well. Do you like tomatoes and ketchup crisps? Yeah. They're very good, aren't they? I've got a three and a half hour taxi drive back to the airport, so I'm just gonna chill, do some work, try and get some sleep, and enjoy the crisps. If only I had some ketchup to dip these crisps in. So I'm jumping in with you now. You're taking me to airport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You drop, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. So do I pay you or? Yeah, yeah, for okay. me. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye. -bye. Bye. Thank you very much, thank you, bye. And we are back in Amman Airport. The next stop is New Delhi in India for the Taj Mahal. This next flight's gonna be a killer, it's like 10 hours. I've gotta to fly to Muscat in Oman first, so by Dubai, and then I change there and then fly on to New Delhi. Three wonders down, four to go. Let's hope the Taj goes as smooth as the last three. Right, I'll see you tomorrow.